Welcome to This Week in Anime History, where I talk about things that happened this week in anime history, starting back in 1970, the first episode of Ashira no Joe, a.k.a. Tomorrow's Ooh. Joe, from yes. here in Japan. Yeah, the uh, famous boxing manga and anime. Uh, this is the one which, and I tell this story every year, um, um, not long before the anime adaptation came out, one of the characters in the manga had passed away, which led to a public funeral for the character on the streets of Tokyo. That's how popular it was. So yeah, Shirido Joe, big deal. Um, very successful, very popular, and uh, became the pattern for a lot of the uh, sports anime that came afterwards. Uh, moving forward quite a bit to 1997, a certain anime named Pokemon aired on in Japan. The first Pokemon? Time. Exactly. Can you believe 1997, almost 25 years ago, the original Ash, Misty, and Brock uh, Pokemon anime series aired in Japan. It did pretty well. Um, a day later, saw the premiere of Revolutionary Girl Utena, uh, the now well-known kind of shoujo manga rethink, really weird kind of anime series. It's, it's amazing and and uh, a lot going on there. Um, aired the, the same, yeah, same season as Pokemon. Really, really cool. Um, jumping forward um, a, uh, about a decade. Um, on April 2nd as well, saw the premiere of The Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya, which was a um, pretty big deal when it came out. Very, very popular. Um, the light novels had been fairly successful, but uh, boy, this blew the, those just kind of out of the water and was arguably the first really, really big Kyoto animation anime series. Um, they'd done stuff before that. They'd worked on Full Metal Panic and so forth. But this was kind of the, the show they blew up with. Uh, Melancholy of Harvey Suzumiya, leading to, obviously, the second season and the movies and so forth and so on. Um, and then jumping forward, a few years after that, can you believe it? Uh, nine years ago, Toonami returned to Cartoon Network with uh, Tom jumping back in the saddle. A uh, very happy day for a lot of us old yes. school Toonami and anime fans. Um, we got Toonami back on April, April Fools, uh, and turned into a real thing, which is really cool. Yep. That is this week in Anime History. See you next time.